If you're like me, you have one of the original Waydo Flyer 1 e-foil boards. The original hardware for the battery clip needs to be updated or replaced with a washer like this to provide a head or resistance to keep the plastic clip from simply popping off and your battery potentially falling out, which is not good. So this clip is finished and this clip over here needs to be finished. I hope you'll excuse my shaky hands. I have shakier hands than normal people in this video. So we're going to remove the screw from this one and we're gonna put it in lock position so that it doesn't wiggle so much when we are um, taking the screw out. And the reason you don't want it to wiggle too much is because underneath you're going to find three washers. For removing the bolts, you want to lift the battery clip straight upwards carefully in order to not misplace the three washers. The three washers are either going to remain on the inside of the clip as shown here, or they'll stay on top of the uh, insert there. You do not want them to fall into the recess around the insert. But if they do, you can just use a pair of needle nose pliers to pull them out of the cavity. The needle nose pliers can also be used to push the bolt out of the plastic uh, clip, as I had to do with this one. Uh, the three washers will have two sides. There is a rounded, more shinier side, and the bottom is flat, with a flat finish. You want the rounded side to be facing up, and the flat side to be facing down. One method you can put these washers back onto the mount of the insert for the... Just put the screw into the hole and then pull it out and they'll be right back on top ready to go. Next we're going to take this black sleeve off of the bolt. You will notice that there's some blue Loctite where the black sleeve used to be so it's going to take a little bit of elbow grease, some wiggling, use a rubber band for some grip also to protect the sleeve from getting scratched and beaten up as you pull it off moment we've all been waiting for we can finally add that washer to the bolt remember the round side up and the flat side down use the pliers to squeeze the black sleeve back on look how beautiful it is compared to what it used to look like with no resistance to slipping out use some blue loctite on the end put it back into the plastic lock and slip it carefully back on so that it goes through the washers. And you're done, all you have to do is tighten it back up. But what I do recommend, which is not shown in here, is you put the battery into your board and tighten it so that it is tight to the battery. Otherwise, when you get back out on the water, you may find that you have made it too tight. So be sure to take this tool out with you on your next trip in case you need to loosen your locks or if you need to tighten your locks. Be prepared. Bring this tool with you. Just a reminder, please check the comments below to see if there's any updates from myself, other viewers, and owners of the Waydo Flyer 1. They may have some additional suggestions that will help you undertake this procedure to change your locks. When you do this procedure, you may find yourself wondering the same as myself, why this wasn't something that was done in the first place. Until these bolts are changed by yourself or way do in future iterations of this product, I would advise that you not turn your board upside down, especially in the water. You would not want to have your battery fall out in the water. Just so you know, the same size of hex tool that you're going to use to take the bolts out of your battery locks is the same tool you're going to use to remove your handles if you ever decide to plasti dip your board a different color as I have done. Have a righteous day, thanks for watching, and live life to the foilist.